The Hamilton County Grand Jury has indicted Tavia Chapman on multiple counts, including murder and endangering a child for killing an innocent man. He was simply walking into Kroger when he got caught in the middle of this violent encounter. Now, you can see Juwan Lunsford walking towards a car holding a grocery bag, and Christopher Griffith is seen using a cane heading into Kroger. Now, we're not showing the exact moment the two men were hit. The SUV plows into Lunsford first and then strikes Griffith. The driver has been identified as Tavia Chapman. She gets out of the car and begins beating up Lunsford, who's the father of her child. Griffith died from his injuries. Chapman was indicted today on one count of aggravated murder, two counts of murder, two counts of felonious assault, one count of attempted murder, and one count of endangering children. If she's convicted on all of these charges, she faces a possible sentence of life in prison. After she plows into these two people, killing the one man, um, her car was disabled. She exited the vehicle, leaving her eighth-month-old baby in the car, and proceeds to go to her boyfriend and start beating him after he's been run over by this car. The prosecutor says he does not believe that eight-month-old baby was injured in all of this, but you can see from the video that after Chapman beat up Lunsford, she then goes back into the car, grabs the baby, and then tried to flee the scene. But the prosecutor said it was those bystanders that made sure she did not leave the scene until police arrived. Reporting live, Rachel Hersheimer, WLWT News 5.